Cubase Pro 9.5 expands upon the popular zone concept introduced in Cubase Pro 9. There are four different zones. You have a left zone, a project zone, an edit zone, and a right zone. And you can hit the tab key to navigate to make particular zones active. If you wanted to navigate between different parts within a particular zone or different tabs, you can hold down Command, Option, or you could hold down alt control plus the left and right arrows. So within the Cubase 9.5, there's some additions here on the right zone. The media has also been enhanced. So if we wanted to look at various virtual instruments here, we can now drag and drop your Steinberg instruments and place it directly into your project like so. If I wanted to find different presets we can navigate these very easily plus we have a direct file browser so if you wanted to look for particular files that are in your system or looking for drum loops project files we can come directly here without the need to go directly to the operating system level the control room has also been integrated directly into the right zone, which is a popular feature request after we place the mix console here. Here we can have an independent volume that doesn't affect the gain structure of the mixer. We could switch between different speakers that are connected to our audio interface. We could also have different down mix presets, so if I want to listen to this in stereo or mono. And we can have up to four different Q mixes for headphones for people that are being recorded that we could have access to. Going to our inserts, we could actually, for our monitors, we could set the levels independently for each speaker and apply plugins if necessary. The last tab that we have is going to be our meter tab. So here we could have very detailed metering fixed on the right hand side. So if you want to see uh, digital scale, DIN, EBU, Nordic, CAT system 20, 14, 12. And if we wanted to have our loudness meter, we can just come directly here and see that we could have our R128 or LUFS or loudness units meters all directly integrated into the right zone. So you can see that the changes in Cubase with the right zone can really speed up your workflow process and make it ideal if you're working with a single screen system like a laptop. 